Hi beautiful angels. Welcome to the Divine Guidance by Renu. My name is Renu and I'm a tutor tarot reader. Today I'll be doing the tarot reading for July 27th and if you like the video please like, share and subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell icon for uh, for the notifications for all of my upcoming videos. So let's start with the and please uh, Thank you, thank you, thank you for new people who are uh, um, coming on my channel and all my new and old subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your positive uh, comments and for your liking, sharing and subscribing. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. So let's start with the reading for the uh, day of July 27th. So let's see what will be the overall energy on this day. So... The first card is here is the eight of pentacles and the next card is here is the page of wands so what it tells about uh, tells me that what are you guys doing you are focused on something and working really really hard on that it could be your skill that you're trying to master that skill you're trying uh, you're taking some courses on that it might benefit you also uh, financially too um, if you want to start something and use that skill at your um, in your career to start with a new career new job uh, new business venture so uh, I think you are learning and very focused and definitely we see the pentacles over there it means it gonna be definitely benefit you and provide you the abundance in the future and uh, page of wants that definitely uh, some of you if you're thinking of starting something new related it could be related to that skill or some anything uh, uh, you are learning so if you are trying to learn something you're thinking of that this this card is making sure that yeah it is a good time to learn learn and master your skill so it will be helpful for you and second scenario what i see here that uh, if you are parents of the young children because the pages are the young young energy the learner so you're trying to motivate or encourage your children to move forward so you're helping them maybe you're supporting them you're um, you know, encouraging them to start something new, to start something new at business place or maybe um, at work or encouraging them to learn something or sending them any college or university. Uh, it could be that too if you're a parent. So next card over here we'll take is the health. It's about health. So the health on... Uh, on July 27th, the first card is here, the sun and the fool. So what I feel in the sun, it will be very positive, very healthy, very, um, you know, happy, happy vibes over here with the sun card. So you will be very joyful. You will uh, spend time with the kids, going to the park, going to the ocean and spending time in nature, right? So it's very beautiful card. So recently, if you weren't feeling good, or low vibe the sun card is like taking and is a very vibrant energy and taking all that negative energy and bringing you very positive and happy energy over here so be grateful if you are getting that kind of energy that you are uh, like feeling out of the world here and so please be grateful so that you can maintain that positive happy energy with you uh, the fool over here is like uh, if you have learned lesson or learned something about yourself being in the uh, you know if you had some health issues recently so you have learned something about yourself and you will try to and planning to implement to improve your health it could be anything like it could be related to the yoga exercise new diet changes in your previous diet it could be anything you're able to you're wanting to uh, to uh, make those changes so that you can maintain this health you know which is really really good so i would suggest don't just plan it please take action move forward with that whatever you think will be beneficial for you uh, to maintain your health so yeah i was also uh, used to drink a lot of uh, tea but i have reduced it to the one cup in a day so i think it it made a big change big difference in my health so 
definitely you're doing or thinking something to make changes for your health on this day so next card over here is the career and finance so that is a ten of swords so few people are uh, you I think you know already that's why you are already learning something uh, that you already know that that uh, something has ended at your workplace it could be any idea, any habit, any old routine, old beliefs related to the work, how you're supposed to work. And also we can see that the changes happening um, uh, around us these days, we are changing. Most of the people who used to go outside to work now, they have to change their routine working from home. So don't hesitate to make the changes because eventually you have to do it so why to stress out to make that changes just adopt it just go with the wind just don't don't hesitate don't resist because it will be painful when you resist just go with the flow 10 is don't focus too much on 10 focus on one out of 10 I would suggest that focus on one since we have a page over here and a Sun card here and the fool here it means uh, beside this uh, ten of swords nature is also God is also um, giving an opportunity that to start something new so don't get scared of the ten of swords so make the changes which will be beneficial for your work place so it could be anything that you want to update your business you want to start with something new plan or new products at your workplace it could be something anything that you want to update at your workplace and you should know already uh, it's not working so find out what is not working because it's a ten of swords here it's not gonna work the old way of working wouldn't work now so you have to make the changes according to that so next card over here is the relationship love and relationship so that's a ten of wands and seven of wands so what I feel over here that with the uh, with the ten of wands that you are carrying some kind of burden in the relationship you might be the person who doing the whole thing just giving 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 and not receiving anything from out of this relationship it means now over the years it becomes burden for you this relationship and you're just carrying that burden around around you because it is um, love is all about equal give and take but in this situation what i see that you are just giving giving away not getting it back anything that is a very mentally physically and emotionally stressful for you you might have a backache these days or it is causing uh, um, um, health issues too for you so it's kind of stagnant energy around you that is, there is draining your energy uh, draining your uh, you know spiritual energy one way you're working spiritually on something and second that you are because of this relationship you're draining your energy so it's like a total draining 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 and not getting anything positive for yourself so and let this baggage go because it's a 10 already we have two tens there so seven of wands what I, what it does uh, seven of wands i would suggest you to set up some healthy boundaries if if you think the, there are people around you that uh, that is uh, you know draining your energy so you need to need to set some boundaries so you can maintain your positive joyful happy energy and uh, and also at the same time uh, make sure uh, you watch the videos and do some guided meditation to cleanse your aura to shield your aura you know um, so that you can maintain that um, healthy energy uh, around you that spiritual energy don't just let people drain your energy all the time set some healthy boundaries and uh, next card over here is the from the angel beloved one archangel camel i'm helping you with your spiritual soulmate relationship so if you are thinking of i'm not worthy enough for this relationship i'm not worthy of love but don't think that because archangel camel is working for you to find out or you to take it to once you're done with this release that energy and it, uh, Archangel is ready to take you into the next relationship because she's working behind the scene for you for this uh, next soulmate relationship 
it's a spiritual relationship next card over here hello from heaven on this day july 27th uh, i see that uh, you might get to see some signs and numbers from the angels because they are sending you the messages that your loved ones in heaven are doing fine let go of worries and feel their loving blessings so take care of like um watch those signs don't just ignore them don't just so be in the present moment enjoy the present moment so you can uh, get that you know healthy um, you know happy vibration when you see those kind of signs uh, around you so knowing that it is the sign from heaven so visualization so visualization tells me over here that uh, fairies are asking you to whatever you trying to manifest at your career place at your uh, sorry at your workplace at your uh, in your relationship whatever you're trying to manifest it would be easy to manifest if you're visualizing make the vision board or visualize uh, uh, during meditation visualize that your soulmate is there visualize that everything is good is happening at your workplace or you want to boost your creativity visualize that that you are making those um, your craft or the, your projects so visualize that because it will be easier for you to manifest your uh, dreams through visualizations so the last card here is the hidden truth so yesterday is begging you with great fatigue let me alone please i really do not suit you anymore obviously you're gonna say that if you yesterday was uh, very draining for you and today you have the sun card for your health it means you are out of that energy right leave that yesterday's fatigue or um, negative energy alone enjoy that movement and be grateful so that's it for the July, July 27th and please take care of yourself and keep your vibes high. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching and please uh, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel and see you tomorrow. Bye for now.